We're here at the laundry mat this morning and free food like this. The daily nutrients. Yep, at the laundry mat. <laughs> Hallelujah. I had a big old coffee stain hit me in LA, <laughs> fell on me. So I had it on there for a little while already. I washed everything separately, the white one by itself, the robes by itself because of the white whiteness of it they already got some zote on there some pre-bar soap you got a pad for you got a sketch pad for rolling deep so you may continue his art uh, continue chopping the arms off of the menorah and that was it right there that you heard so we had already rubbed zote this this is a it's like powerful, so weird. We already rubbed it on the on the robes with that water. So yeah, we I washed everything separate. I just cleaned this one out and I put all the other gold stuff in here. The cape is filthy already. My mantle robes are there with we got shot with. Um, I don't know where my hair is. Forgive me. I got shot with coffee right on the side over here. Alright. We're washing the robes. And this is pretty cool because we're getting close to the 400 video on the Up of Love, y'all. Yeah? On the ultimate pilgrimage of love, beholding Yahuwah. And uh, we're washing the robes. Now we got to put some Clorox and uh, soap. Hallelujah, it's by itself, the robes, it's holiness, the holy garments, so I do always do it separate from all my clothes. Uh, yeah. And this is a must, the softener, this makes it smell so good, I love washing with this, hallelujah. Yeah, not for the next. Not for the water. You can't put all of it, but we'll put about almost the bottom left. A little extra squirt won't hurt nobody. So we almost got it the way we wanted it. We should wash it pretty good. I have to do everything by myself still. My father has not gifted me this perfect wife. He can do it. He hasn't yet. So we're waiting on that. Hallelujah. So then we have to work for ourselves and keep it ourselves going. Hallelujah. The leathers. I have only two zip seats, but I have them. They come off in the name. Hallelujah. Almost coming to the 400 episode to show you again. The robes what I've been wearing the whole time. I even wash them about every week or so. Week, week and three days. I think it's solid, so when it's solid, I can just start the base, cut at the base. Since it's solid, it looks like it's solid, so you have to just kind of start cutting it at the base instead. It's more awesome. We can make it into a holy menorah. It is solid, so it's solid, it means I can cut more at the base and make it look awesome. Hallelujah. Here at the laundry mat. And this Sabbath. My schedule's not like everybody's schedules. I need to buy a shower. Five bucks, which is light ease, and uh, yeah, I gotta do everything for myself. I don't have a wife, I might have to move to Jerusalem like Abraham was. Abraham, King Abraham, was told to move to the land of Chaldeans, and it's for that land is for a seed, and that's me, and that's all of you. So, you know, one day we end up going over there, we might find a wife there. I always wanted a Colombian and Brazilian, you know, why. Um, they have a lot of soul, a lot of spirit, and a lot of goodness. Uh, what did I hear? Israelite women are beautiful too, I don't know. 
And these are from my land, my brother's land, father's land. Getting ready for the 400 episode. I think I might know what it is, what it might be like. Hallelujah. Almost coming. Almost there. Yeah, I mean, we're getting some little gold chips on the screen. Yeah, I felt it snap. Yeah. Gonna see if the brother dedicates it, rededicate re re so that we may rededicate it to a regular menorah, a holy menorah, constructed menorah. Hallelujah! We got to burn our arm off again. Rededicating another one. We're gonna get the brother to see if he does it. We're gonna see his colors because he told me yesterday, Yasharel is not recognized by a star. Six pointed star, it's recognized by the menorah. This is the menorah, not the Hanukkah menorah. Mm. Hallelujah! Yeah, here we are. Just watch it pop. No, not yet. Yeah. Begin in the laundromat. Still is done at the laundromat. Working up to the 400 episode, and we have our new menorah. Awesome, and it's metal. It was pretty hard work, eh? Look at that. I needed the saw here. Hallelujah to this little saw. Bought it with medium metal. It was some work. Hallelujah. I do not subscribe to the Jews believes the Zionist Jews, the Orthodox Jews that are uh, uh, the modern day here that are in Israel today. I know your brothers, your love would do it, if you're for the Mashiach, it's no longer the land, it's no longer the people. I mean, it's going to come through us when we hold the commandments and keep them, which the Messiah opened up the gates for everybody. But... Uh, we were the first ones to mess up. We were the first ones to do other idle things, like put an extra, like, uh, defile the menorah, which was instructed on, uh, in about Exodus, about Exodus 20, the building of the Ark of the Covenant menorah. We didn't build it exactly how it was. You could die. And they just decided to add one on there. That was already the facade. The father had already left the temple by that point. Uh, because of our disobedience and all this kind of leaven that they would throw in there, it's still happening today. We were like the first Catholics, the uh, modern Hebrews, the modern Jews right now. So, you know, that's how we are. But it's the Mashiach. Mashiach, this represents the Messiah. It only strikes seven arms. So, we always end up cutting off the two from the menorahs and rededicating it and recleaning our souls, recleaning our things, our items, holy items, as we clean our. Our robes here on this Shabbat. Hallelujah. May the brothers want to rededicate it as we work for our 400th episode. This is 400. This will be 499. Stay tuned to the Hub of Love. Hallelujah. We're in uh, Ariel, Los Angeles right now. We're still working our way into Los Angeles with the painting. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. This is a normal laundry day, it looks like. And we're gonna give it, we're setting things up for the up of love. Get yours, get yours with a donation of 15 bucks and over. If you do donate something, get this. Oh, we gotta, yeah. We gotta include the CD as part of the thing. This goes as a sleeve inside the CD. All the connections, you know, are we're there. Uh, Up of Love, YouTube as well. The Yahweh Yeti, well, man, it's kind of locked on me. Uh, 
this goes inside the sleeve little extra info of uh, revelations things that you someone that doesn't read much you know it took me a month to put together and the background is all the scriptures i would want to give someone with this much amount of space it took me a month to get together just these scriptures will do you good if you don't read that much i hope you read this much this is the spanish translation of the cd the spanish translation to seven songs Yahusha Mashiach. so you see all in spanish really good songs everybody loves the demo Yahusha Mashiach, La Torah, all in Spanish, all in Spanish, Hallelujah, Yahweh Yeti, all this comes with a CD, $15 or more, you get it, and everybody loves it, we open it up, that's what you get, hey, you see there's a sleeve there, Yahweh Yeti, had to put some uh, updated versions, Putting the new stuff on the CDs again. Find me here and all these other uh, outlets or these branches. Speaking of branches, here they are. <laughs> and again, the scriptures. And this is why I'm doing it. This is the number one thing. This is my thesis. This is what I came up with. Being all those for everything that I'm saying to you came from. So you know, this is going with a dedication getting ready for the 400th episode which started a laundromat it's still going preaching at a laundromat as well so yeah this is my whole setup I'm always carrying these things as you can see my books my bags my laundry bag and hallelujah champion I'm at everything's done we're in zero now hallelujah time to dry shalom